Ever wondered what it takes to move mountains or dig massive mines? From colossal excavators to gigantic mining trucks, these engineering marvels are designed to tackle the toughest jobs on Earth. Join us as we explore the sheer scale, incredible power, and mind-blowing capabilities of these massive machines that shape our world in ways you wouldn't believe. Let's explore two colossal machines known for their massive excavation capabilities. The Marion 6360, often called the Captain, was a massive power shovel built by the Marion Power Shovel Company in 1965. Weighing about 15,000 tons, it was one of the largest land vehicles ever made. The Captain had a gigantic 215-foot boom and a huge 180-cubic-yard dipper, which could carry up to 300 tons of material. It was driven by 20 electric motors that together produced nearly 30,000 horsepower. Despite its enormous size, it moved at a slow pace of just 0.25 miles per hour. The Captain was mainly used for strip mining at the Captain Mine in Illinois. Remarkably, it needed only a four-person crew to operate it. The Tuckroff Bagger 293, also known as the Man Tuckroff RB293, is an enormous bucket wheel excavator and one of the largest land vehicles ever built. Built by the German company Tuckroff in 1995, this colossal machine stands 315 feet tall and stretches 738 feet long weighing a remarkable 14,200 metric tons. It runs on an external power source that provides 16.56 megawatts, or 22,207 horsepower. The Bagger 293 has a 70-foot rotating wheel with 18 buckets, each capable of holding 15 cubic meters of material. It can move 240,000 cubic meters of earth every day, making it crucial for large mining operations. Currently, it operates in the Hambach Brown coal mine in Germany. Despite its immense size, it only needs a crew of five to operate. Now let's dive into the world of powerful bulldozers. The Komatsu D575A is the largest bulldozer in the world. It was introduced in 1991 and has a powerful 12-cylinder turbocharged diesel engine. This engine produces an impressive 1,150 horsepower. The D575A comes in two versions, the Super Ripper and the Super Dozer. The Super Dozer can move up to 125 cubic yards of material with its large blade. The Bulldozer is huge, measuring 38 feet in length, 24 feet in width, and 16 feet in height. It weighs about 336,400 pounds. Its tracks give it great traction, making it effective on tough terrains. The D575A can dig as deep as 6 feet 9 inches using its single shank ripper. Used mainly for surface mining, it is also valuable in heavy construction and quarrying. This giant bulldozer's size and power make it a crucial tool in these industries, capable of handling large-scale projects. The Caterpillar 6090FS is a massive hydraulic mining shovel, weighing 1,000 tons and capable of holding up to 55 cubic meters in its bucket. It runs on two Cummins QSK-60 engines, each providing 2,150 horsepower for a total of 4,500 horsepower. This machine is essential for heavy mining tasks, moving large amounts of soil and rock in surface mining operations. It features advanced hydraulic systems and a sturdy build for reliable, high-efficiency performance. The 6090FS has a reach of 19.3 meters and a tear-out force of 2,502 kilonewtons, allowing it to handle extremely tough materials. Its electronic control system enhances both performance and fuel efficiency. Used in mines around the world, from coal mines in the United States to gold mines in Australia, the 6090FS is a key player in modern mining. Now let's highlight two of the world's most impressive cranes. The SGC-250, often called Big Carl, is the world's largest land-based crane, built by the company Sarens. Introduced in 2018, this enormous crane can handle a maximum load moment of 250,000 metric tons, meaning it can lift up to 5,000 metric tons. 
Its main boom stretches from 118 meters to 160 meters, and its jib can extend up to 100 meters, giving it a total height of about 250 meters and a working radius of 275 meters. The crane is powered by 12 engines and six power packs, ensuring it operates safely and efficiently. The SGC250 features a double ring design with an outer diameter of 48.5 meters, which helps distribute its weight and reduces ground pressure. It is currently used at the Hinkley Point C nuclear power plant in the UK, where it lifts heavy components for construction. Remarkably, it can lift the equivalent of 32 single-story houses or 1,600 cars at a 40-meter radius. The Liebherr LR13000 is the world's most powerful conventional crawler crane with an impressive maximum lifting capacity of 3,000 tons. 3,300 tons? This crane has a flexible boom system that can be set up in four different ways with a maximum boom length of 472, 4 feet, and a jib length of 413 feet. It is powered by two Liebherr eight-cylinder turbo diesel engines, each generating 1,000 kilowatts, which ensures it performs exceptionally well. The LR13000 can work without extra derrick ballast because of its increased turntable ballast, making it very adaptable and efficient in tight spaces. It is mainly used in building power plants and refineries, where it lifts extremely heavy parts. Interestingly, despite its enormous size, the crane's components can be transported easily and cost-effectively, as the concrete ballast units fit into standard 20-foot containers. Explore the engineering marvels designed for bridge construction. The SLJ932, also known as the Iron Monster, is an enormous bridge construction machine created by the Shijiazhuang Railway Design Institute and built by Beijing Wow Joint Machinery Company. This massive launching gantry measures 91 meters in length, 7 meters in width, and 9 meters in height, and it weighs about 580 metric tons. It has a 64-wheel drive system split into four sections, which helps it move and position itself accurately. Powered by a diesel engine, the SLJ932 can travel at speeds of up to 8 km per hour without any load and 5 km per hour when carrying bridge segments. Its main job is to lift, transport, and place prefabricated bridge sections, which greatly speeds up construction. Remarkably, it can build up to 730 bridge spans before needing replacement. It is extensively used in major infrastructure projects in China, like the Yibin Jinsha River Railway Bridge, proving its efficiency and advanced engineering. Big Muskie was an enormous dragline excavator built by Busiris Erie and used by the Central Ohio Coal Company. Weighing 13,500 short tons and standing almost 22 stories high, it was the largest single bucket digging machine ever made. Its massive bucket could hold 220 cubic yards of material, equivalent to two Greyhound buses parked side by side. Powered by electricity, Big Muskie had 18 motors that produced a total of 24,192 horsepower. This colossal machine could move 39 million pounds of earth and rock every hour, uncovering valuable coal deposits in southeastern Ohio. It was in operation from 1969 until 1991, during which it moved 483 million tons of material. Remarkably, the bucket alone weighed 230 short tons when empty. Today, the bucket is displayed at Miners Memorial Park in Ohio, honoring this impressive feat of engineering. Lastly, let's examine the largest machines ever built. The Taisun Crane, based at Yantai Raffles Shipyard in China, is the largest gantry crane in the world. It can lift an incredible 20,000 metric tons and stands 436 feet tall. Designed by Dalian Huarui Heavy Industry, it holds the Guinness World Record for lifting the heaviest load ever with a crane, reaching 20,133 metric tons. The crane has a span of 120 meters, 394 feet, and uses almost 50,000 meters of wire rope 
It's mainly used for installing large components on offshore vessels like semi-submersibles and floating production storage and offloading units. By enabling the simultaneous construction of a vessel's top and bottom parts, the Tysun crane helps speed up project timelines and enhances safety and quality. In 2008, it was honored with the Woelfel Best Mechanical Engineering Achievement Award for its significant contributions to the offshore industry. The Bagger 288 is an enormous bucket wheel excavator built by Krupp for the German company Rhein Braun. Finished in 1978, it was the heaviest land vehicle in the world at 13,500 metric tons until 1995. Standing 315 feet tall and measuring 721 feet long, it is truly gigantic. Powered by 16, 56 megawatts of electricity. It has a total driving power of 22,207 horsepower. This massive machine can dig up 240,000 tons of coal or overburden each day, which is like excavating a soccer field 98 feet deep. It moves on 12 caterpillar tracks and travels at a speed of just 0.1 to 0.6 kilometers per hour. The Bagger 288 is mainly used in the Hambach surface mine in Germany to clear away overburden before coal mining begins. Despite its size, it only needs five operators and even has its own small kitchen and bathroom on board. Which of these colossal machines impressed you the most? Let us know in the comments. If it's if world's biggest machines, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more incredible content.